Yo, what's good guys? Welcome back to another video. Man, I am loving this new room. There's so much more space for me to do my videos here and for my reptiles. And also, I have so much more things to do, guys. Like, all this right behind me, if you guys can even see with the lighting, um, all that's going to go to the other side of the wall. Like, I plan to move all this right here on that wall. So I have a lot of stuff to do. I also want to put a couch here, my fridge there, and just get new carpet and everything. But anyways guys, today's video is going to be a video of me showing my new reptile. I was supposed to show you guys in my last video, but I decided to wait for Dave Kaufman's video. But unfortunately, he couldn't make it this time after the reptile show because he had some things going on and he couldn't make it to LA. So we had to reschedule that for next time. And I kind of preferred that too because my room's not even done yet. Like I just moved in, so I kind of want him to come to once my room is complete. So. I look forward to that. But I'm not gonna wait to show you guys my new reptile until it comes next time. So I'm just gonna show you guys in this video. But before I show you that, let's go get some food for them. All right, so for those of you who don't know, I did recently just move, so I had to find a new spot to pick up my feeders for my reptiles. Um, I did find this spot, but it was like 15 minutes away. So I didn't really wanna go that far all the time. And I kept looking and I found this spot that sells all the feeders I need, but it's a fish store. So <laughs> there's no reptiles there. So I can't show you guys any reptiles, but I can show you guys some fish. So hope you guys enjoy this little montage. <laughs> Alright, made it back home. I got my crickets here. I already got some calcium in there in this container with them. So I'm going to feed them off to my cob lizards right now. And are you guys ready to see my new lizards? So, I'll give you guys a hint. They are something I already have, but a different locale. So make some guesses right now if you know what it is. Alright, I'll give you five seconds. Hurry up, go coming, I'm waiting. <laughs> Alright guys, so, are you ready? I'm about to turn it around. Three, two, one. So what you're saying is it's not enough Just write it off like a prescription drug You've been fussing how we never touch But who can bother with this kind of fussing When we've been walking this blind Frustrated, outdated, what's on your mind? Draw for this time, all on the line Try trading me places Like the camera does not do them justice. Like literally somebody grabbed this lizard and dipped him in highlighter. Like seriously, he's like so bright and yellow. Like look at this guy, turn around. They can see you. And then his girlfriend over here as well. She's not as bright as him, but like, check this stud out. Like, oh my God, so awesome. Uh, I just can't stop staring at them, honestly. Like, when I first got them, I was here like all day just watching them. Like, he is so nice. And I feel like the camera does not do it justice at all. You need to see this in person, because in person, like, 
you need sunglasses to look at this guy. He's so bright and yellow. Like this, I don't know, guys. Like I'm so happy. Like he was a bell boy. I had to get him, and then I got the female so I can start breeding them. Like guys, I love color desert. You can't already tell. Like I have these guys up here now, my breeding pair. I have Hades in here. He's of course hiding in that hide back there. I'll get some food out right now. Hopefully he comes out. And then Zeus. Hey Zeus. Zeus, come come meet your new roommate. Come here. I want to show you. No, Zeus, come here. No, come here. No, Zeus, please. I'm trying to show you your new roommate. God dang, Zeus. You do not want to be handled, huh? First time. Wait, right there. Don't move. Look at that, guys. Zeus. Like, this is just yellow right here. And that guy is yellow all around. Well, he's hiding back there, but obviously I'm not going to put him in there because he'll fight. How do you like your new roommate, Zeus? What do you think? What should we name him, too? Because all my other color legends have Greek god names. Now these two need some Greek god names. So you guys need to help me out down in the comments down below. Comment some awesome names for this guy and for her as well. We had Zeus. We have Hades. And then over here is Poseidon. Man, Poseidon, maybe one day you'll be as nice as Zeus. Oh, look at that. I'm sorry, okay, 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 let me put you away. Dang, Poseidon, look at that. Trying to fight Zeus or what? Man, you got nothing on Zeus. He's like twice your size, guy. Okay, okay, I'll put him away. It was for two seconds. All right, Zeus, go back to your girlfriend's there. Man, Poseidon wants to fight you, Zeus. You didn't even care. Poseidon, what are, you, what are you doing over there, huh? You trying to fight already? Trying to see who's the most dominant guy. <laughs> Look at this guy, he's turning really nice too. His colors are more like a sky blue. Also, he's going through a shed right now too. Like, for sure, he was a lot more bluer like last week. So, I feel like once he sheds, he's gonna be extremely blue. And he is slowly starting to get those yellow sides, like those yellow lines on his side right there in the back, and also on his head too. But, anyways, let's go back to the new additions up here. Y'all are still in the same exact spot. Alright, let's feed this guy to see them in action. But first, look at Apollo. He looks like he's half asleep. Look at his eye. <laughs> oh man. He is such a character. You guys ready to eat? Oh, they see it. They know it's coming for sure. Alright, I threw a few in there. Bam. But yeah, really guys. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me close this. Let me close this. Crickets are getting out. But yeah, guys, damn, they're fat. <laughs> Look at that. He's so quick. Zeus doesn't run that fast. <laughs> Zeus is a little bit overweight. But yeah, guys, comment down some names for them below. Um, I kind of want to keep it with that Greek god name. So be creative. I know you guys always have like really creative names. And whoever is the winner, I'll shout you out in my next video when I pick the best name. Man, y'all are fast. And then she is a little bit uh, skinny right now because before I bought her, she did lay some eggs. So I'm trying to put her back on some weight. I've been feeding her some pinkies, some dubia roaches, and crickets. So uh, she is definitely getting back on track with her weight. And look at her. She just doesn't fail to eat. Look at those tails, though. You guys, I've been watching them running here back and forth with this huge enclosure and with these lizards they can run on their back hind legs and they use that tail for whoa see how fast that was they use that tail for balance let's see if hades is hungry uh he's probably already sleeping let's see if i can get him to come out hades there's food come eat all right if he sees them he'll come out Oh, he definitely sees it. Let's poke him out. Hades, there you are. Getting a little grumpy monkey. Look at him. Look at that stance, though. <laughs> While well, he's standing like that. 
Do you see all those black markings and spots that he's getting under his neck? That collar is really defined now. Look at that collar on his legs, on its sides. Like he's getting so cool. Um, but with him, he likes larger prey, honestly. Like little crickets, he'll get them here and there. But like he likes to take down like pinkies and big doobie roaches. I try to give him a small doobie roach. He's like, nope, I don't want that. And then I give him like a, a huge adult male doobie roach and he'll just, he, I don't know, he loves like big larger prey for some reason. And he's still not full size grown yet. He's still going to get a lot bigger than that. Zeus, are you hungry? Let's feed you guys as well. The other female back there. I'm pretty sure Zeus is always hungry so he's never going to not want to eat. Like, you, see, you see, look at him. How, how do you even see the food already? Oh, you too. Oh, they both hungry. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is not for everybody. <laughs> There's one on his head. You see that? <laughs> oh, man. Hey, Zeus, there's, there's one on your head. He still doesn't notice it. And then she got them, too. And Zeus is still hungry. I wonder where the other female went. I think she's hiding. You see those yellows on this female right here? It's a different kind of yellow. Like this one's like more of like for the aqua flames. That yellow goes through the whole back. But if you notice on the lightning yellow, there's like stripes. And they're like more vibrant. They come from like that New Mexico line where they come like in brownish, like dull grayish, with a little bit of yellows, but the breeder I got them from, um, just been breeding them since 2010, he told me, getting those nicest uh, New Mexicos to get like the nicest yellows on this guy. And by the way, the breeder's name is Colorful Color Lizard Ranch. So go check him out. Oh, I also forgot to mention, you guys are probably commenting me down below right now, but I did notice that he was getting some, I'm not sure if it's like an injury on his, on his mouth or if he bit something, but um, it's been getting better. Like honestly, like last week it was worse than that. And after he shed, it got a lot better. So I'm not sure if he's just hitting himself on something in here or if he bit something, but if it doesn't go away, I'm gonna take him to a vet for sure. But it's not affecting his. It's not affecting his eating. It doesn't look like it's an, it's an infection. It's not moist or anything. It's just kind of dried up. So um, if it doesn't go away, I'm for sure gonna take him to the vet. But for now, he's doing good. Slowly healing. Let's see if Poseidon wants some. Yeah, are you hungry? Or are you still moody? This is Poseidon's setup for now. Until I get him a melamine enclosure like his other pals over there on the other side. But this is this is good enough for him right now. I still need to add some more rocks in here, but this will do for now. All right, let's see if he is hungry. Oh, and by the way, me and Poseidon have the same birthday. Our birthday is on September fifteenth, and. That's why I decided to keep him too, because he was my first um, babies that I've ever hatched out before. And I wanted to keep one of the babies since, first of all, it's, we have the same birthday. And second of all, it's because that was my first ever clutch of babies of color lizards, so I had to keep at least one of them. And it's so cool how we have the same birthday. He's gonna turn one. And I'm turning 23. He's fast too. All right, and then up here I have my baby color lizard that I one that I kept. Um, I sold the other two because they were getting really aggressive towards each other, especially this one. This was the biggest one here, and he started biting the other one's tail. Uh, once they start com basically competing because like the survivor of the fittest, so um, I decided to keep the biggest one. Um, I'm pretty sure he's in there hiding. I don't want to disturb him right now. But, yeah, I decided to keep that one because this is Zeus's baby right here. This is not Zeus's baby. He's not related to Zeus at all. He's a different dad. 
Um, but yeah, this was this was baby in here. So hopefully he's as nice as this when he gets older. Actually, I, I want to show you guys. Like you guys want to see my color widget, right? I I'll take him off for you guys. That's why you were in there, cause you're going through shed right now. Look at that. He's like a little hoodie, like a little jacket going on. <laughs> but yeah, guys, this guy is growing extremely fast. Like he was like double the size of the other two and you can imagine he was just destroying them uh, he will bite their like head when going like, the other one would grab a cricket and he would grab the cricket and their head and just like try to like yank it off like it was bad had to separate them and then I just ended up selling them because um, I didn't want them to get hurt even more so I just decided to keep the biggest one and this guy is a male so he is Zeus's son. Can't wait for him to get older. Man, how many color lizards do I have now? I have, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have a total of eight now. If he's hungry. Oh, yeah, without a doubt. <laughs> Dang, didn't, have, didn't give me a chance to record it. You already ate it. Let's see if he gets another one here. Bam. Get him. Oh, also, this guy needs a name too, guys. I'm going to have so many Greek god names. <laughs> but hey, I like it though. All my pets need names. So, I need three names down below, guys. Comment them one, two, and three. So, one of them is going to be my male lightning yellow. Two is going to be the female lightning yellow. And three is going to be the baby aqua flame. All right, here's a better shot of Hades, my Baja collar lizard. Look at that tail though. See how it's getting vertically compressed? It's a lot different than the other locales. Man, now I have so many, I don't even know which one's my favorite. All right guys, so I'm gonna wrap up the video there. Hope you guys enjoyed my new Reptiles that I have. I'm just so happy guys. I have like a variety of color lizards now like all different colors and different locales Like they're all unique in their own way. So I just love that I can show you guys this as well and I don't know. Let's see where the journey takes us with the breeding project. So hope you guys enjoyed the video I'm also gonna be doing a Q&A while getting a tattoo on my next video so be sure you guys comment some questions down below they don't have to be just reptile related they can be like about anything i don't know you throw me some random questions and i'll answer them for you while getting a tattoo <laughs> all right guys hope you guys enjoyed the video and i'll catch you in the next one peace out